Hey guys, so I thought I would take a minute to do an updated cat stroller video. Um, I've been getting a lot of comments and questions about the original video I posted, like, what was that, like a year and a half ago? So I just kind of wanted to go over it now that I have used it a little bit and Mr. Floof and I are actually on a walk right now. He is super nervous. Um, I haven't taken him on loads of walks, so he's still getting adjusted to it. But let me show you some of the things people are asking a lot of questions about. Okay, so one of the things people were really worried about was the ability for the cat to escape. And so what I found inside are, okay, ignore this. This is my leash harness, but inside of this one, there's like this little strap that you can clip on. And I just found today, <laughs> I've had this for so long, and there was another one hidden under this cushion. So there's two clips, but what I've noticed using this today is that he like keeps turning around and getting all wound up in there. So, um, see, you can see him doing it right now. He's like getting it all knotted. Like I said, he's pretty nervous at the moment because there's a lot of exposure. I usually take him out at night. And so I think because it's daytime, it's like a whole new experience for him. So he's weirdly nervous. But uh, anyway, we're giving it a go. I wanted to do it in daylight so you guys could see everything okay. Anyway, so yeah, two of these in this one. I'm not totally sure if the one I have linked in the description has those because the one that I actually got, I had the original link and it stopped working because I didn't have any more. So I tried to find one that was similar, but hopefully the one I have linked still works and has those inside. The second thing a lot of people were asking about was they were saying they saw reviews of their people's cats escaping. And I'm not exactly sure how, because everything seems really secured. Like the openings are so small, like this is zipped all the way around and up. So the backside's totally secure. And then as far as the front goes, again, zipper pouch, totally sealed shut. This upper area is totally sealed shut. The biggest opening that I can find um, is this area right here. And Zabu literally tried to stick his face out of here and barely, barely got through. Now, I have a big cat, but this is a pretty, like, solid flap. So, I mean, I guess if they tried hard enough, they could probably get out that way. But um, I certainly haven't had that problem. And he's, like, a master escape artist. Someone else was also asking about the fabric. Like, if it stayed wrinkly. And I'm not exactly sure what they mean. I don't think it looks that wrinkly. I mean, it's like that, um, weatherproof material stuff. I don't know how to describe what this is, but that's what it is up close. So it's like that kind of like plasticky fabric. So I don't know. I mean, that's what it looks like a year and a half later. So it's still in good condition. I have no complaints about it. Um, the wheels, I've been holding up great. Um, yeah. Oh, downside though, these cup holders aren't amazing. Like, these are really freaking tiny cup holders, and I realized very quickly that um, they don't really hold anything except for like probably your standard size water bottle, but no like um, refillable water bottles really fit in here. Oh, and another big thing that I've noticed, if this is your pet's first time in a stroller, and they're kind of nervous when they go outside. Well, I would assume if they've never been outside, they're gonna be nervous. But uh, Zabu acts and seems a lot like safer, I would say, when it's completely zipped up and he's inside. When I first started the video, I had the like whole top down so you could see inside. He seems a lot more sketched out when it's down. I thought he would like it more, but he seems way happier when he's like all um, situated and contained. So that would be my recommendation if you're just starting out and trying to feel out the situation. And then you for sure know that your um, pet's not going to get out of there, at least very easily. <laughs> anyway, that was my last little bit. So yeah, I think that's pretty much the majority of the questions I've been receiving. Yeah, if you have any additional ones that I didn't answer, go ahead and leave them in the comments. I'll answer anything that I have an answer to. So yeah, just let me know if you have any questions and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.